What's up guys, this is Jared from Bill Kit Boards and in today's video we're going over everything included in the BKB Duo DIY Electric Skateboard Kit. Let's get started. First up we have the True Flex deck. This is overall 42 and a half inches long and nine and a half inches wide and made of a bamboo composite material. On the top, you have a pre-applied grip tape sheet that is clear, as well as all of the holes are pre-drilled for easy assembly. The board is long enough to give you a wide standing platform and also accommodate the larger six inch pneumatic wheels. The concave on the deck is just enough to keep your feet locked in while still being comfortable for long periods of time. The camber of the deck also allows it to flex perfectly and return to center when you go over a bump. This keeps the ride super stable and gives you more confidence to go faster on a flexible deck. Next up, we have the enclosure. This is made from five millimeter thick ABS and has all of the holes pre-drilled for the ports and to mount it to the deck. There are also two holes at the back for cable glands that provide extra waterproofing. Then we have the 10S3P Samsung 30Q 324 watt hour battery. This will give you around 20 miles of range on the stock setup, which pretty much beats every other board in the price range. The battery also has all of the necessary connections for easy mounting and assembly. Next up, we have the charger. This is 42 volts and three amps, and you can get it in a variety of different connectors. We have the US, AU, EU, and UK available. On the other end, you have a GX12 charge plug for the battery. Following that, you have the two 6354 190kV motors. These provide each 3,000 watts for a total of 6,000 watts of maximum power. Needless to say, your power cravings will be satisfied. Paired with the ESC, which we will go over next, this board will accelerate faster and harder than any board in its price range. Next up, we have the VESC ESC. This is what makes the kit entirely unique and customizable to you. Out of the box, the board has a very aggressive throttle response. With the vest, you can fully adjust both the acceleration and braking sensitivity. It also allows the kit to be fully modular, so if you wanted to change the battery, motors, or remote down the line, you can easily do so. We plan on releasing an entire series of videos going into detail on how to tune the vest to fit your exact riding style. Then, in order to monitor exactly what the board is doing, we have the Bluetooth receiver. This plugs into the vest and allows you to monitor the board in real time and track your rides. There are both iOS and Android versions of the app available. It allows you to view your current speed, battery percentage, and so much more. Following that, we have the bearing set. They're located in this nifty little tin, and inside you can find eight bearings and four spacers. Next up, we have the motor mounts. These are machined from aircraft grade 6061 aluminum and then anodized red. They also have the two threaded holes to easily attach the belt guards. Next up, we have the truck hangers. These are 10 inches wide and based on the Caliber 2 platform. This means that they're gonna be super stable at high speeds while still being carvable at low speeds. There is a front and a back truck, and the back truck has a shorter hanger to accommodate the two wheel pulleys. Next up, we have the base plates. These are again based on the Caliber 2 profile, so any Caliber 2 bushings will work. The stock bushings have a Duro of 96A, which is a good median between stability and carvability. Next up, we have the 97mm 76A skateboard wheels. These have a wide contact patch, meaning you're going to have lots of grip for hard cars. They're also large, which means they're going to absorb a lot of those road vibrations and provide a very comfortable ride. Next up, we have the wheel pulleys. These are 40T and injection molded from nylon. We also have a 48T option available, which we will go over at the end of the video. These pulleys will work with pretty much any flywheel cord wheel, meaning you can swap them out for your preferred wheel if needed. Next up, we have the tool kit. This includes absolutely everything you need to build the BKB Duo. Inside, you'll find four Allen wrenches, one regular wrench, one motor mount spacer, and one tube of Loctite. This ensures that nothing will come loose during your ride. Next up, you'll find another bag, which includes all of the hardware required for assembly, along with the two motor pulleys and T-tool. Specifically, you'll find three individual bags for securing the motor, the trucks, and the enclosure. Next up are the belts. Two are included in the kit, and these are 265M, 12 millimeter wide. We definitely recommend picking up a spare just in case. Next up, we have the risers. There are two fourth inch risers included in the kit, and they're made from a flexible material, which means they're gonna absorb a lot of those road vibrations. The 
last component that comes standard in the kit is the VX1 remote, and you will find it inside this cardboard box. The top LED on the remote is for your status and your speed mode. So if it's solid, you're connected to the board. And then if it's green, you're in the lowest acceleration mode. Orange is the medium acceleration mode. And then red is full 100% power. Below that, we have four LEDs, which indicate how much battery is left on the board itself. Then if you double tap the power button, it will change the four LEDs to show you exactly how much battery is left on the remote itself. Next up, I wanted to go over all of the wheel options and accessories available for the BKV Duo. Starting from left to right, we have the belt guards. These 3D printed belt guards are great for keeping debris out of the drivetrain. By purchasing the belt guards, you get 50% off of replacement belts for the lifetime of the board. Next up, we have the 20T speed upgrade kit. This will drastically increase the overall top speed of the board to a potential of 40 miles per hour. The exact top speed you will reach depends on your wheel size and wheel pulley. So we have a chart available on the website for exact details. Next up are the 48T wheel pulleys. These are just like the pulleys that come standard in the kit, but they are larger. This means you will have more torque and less top speed. This is especially useful with the 120 millimeter cloud wheels, meaning you will have a closer to stock setup with this pulley. We definitely recommend the 48T wheel pulley if you're getting the Flex 2 deck and 120 millimeter cloud wheels. Next up are the 40T Kegel wheel pulleys. These will allow you to use almost any Kegel cord wheel on your BKB Duo. These require no modifications to the wheel or the kit itself, so you just slide off your old pulleys, slide your new pulleys on, and you're good to go. Then we have the rapid charger. This 42 volt 5 amp charger will charge your board in approximately two hours compared to the standard three and a half hour charge time. As you can see, the size of the rapid charger is not that much bigger in comparison to the standard charger. It is definitely a recommended upgrade to get you riding faster. Next up are the 105 millimeter cloud wheels. These wheels are great for rough roads while still having enough grip for hard carves. These are what I use in my personal board and I cannot recommend them enough. Next up are the 120 millimeter cloud wheels in both red and black. These wheels are massive, meaning they will dampen a lot of the road vibrations, but they have a smaller contact patch. This means you won't be able to carve as hard, but in return, you get a more off-road capable wheel. Next up, we have the six inch all-terrain pneumatic wheels. The great thing about pneumatic tires is the ride quality. You simply do not feel the road with these things. You can take on insanely rough roads and go over sidewalks without feeling anything. There is a trade-off with pneumatic wheels though. They use 35 to 45% more battery to provide a smoother ride. This means that you can expect to get less range when using these wheels. Those are all of the wheel options and accessories for the BKB Duo. All of the specifics and details are available on the website, but if you have any other questions, feel free to reach out to support at buildkitboards.com. I hope to see you building and riding a BKB Duo real soon.